Hello everybody, welcome to my channel. It's Eva from Bohemian Crafting and today I'm coming to share with you a swap uh, I decided to do last year but unfortunately then I was um, disturbed by life and I didn't finish mine but I did receive uh, the swap from Jenny and it's so amazing. So before I will show you what I have created for her and I did use images from these two books that was main point of all my creation here so before I will show you what I have created for her uh, I need to show you what she created for me we uh, kind of agreed to do four uh, sides opening book or box so it's opening to four sides and inside are goodies oh three sides and four pockets this way <laughs> i did mine a little bit different way i started with tim holtz paper last year but uh, because i didn't finish that and uh, on the christmas time i received this book uh, i totally swapped what i what i meant to do so this is the beautiful box from jenny and i really love everything she sent uh, she's very talented and i do love everything she add inside uh, so many handmade goodies look at this window with sewn inside flowers and i do believe they are like dry flowers because you know that touch it's not paper punch it's proper flower so all these small little touches here as well it's beautiful it's work of art and she sent me lots of goodies she made lots of beautiful gorgeous tacks and pockets and stuff i can use in my uh, in my journals so this was amazing to go through and to see her work she's really very talented she doesn't have a youtube channel i believe yet but uh, if i do remember right she does have a facebook page i will have to uh, read all messages again because you know I do have only one head and that head doesn't remember everything all the time. So I'm so sorry, but I will add all information to the description box below. So please uh, go to have a look. Uh, I, I do believe she does have a Facebook page where she is sharing her art. So I will add it there for those who would like to have a look. And here is another pocket. And she just created belly band here. And it's really beautiful. Really beautiful. Those papers from Tim Holtz, they are just amazing for those, uh, you know, vintage style, uh, vintage style projects. Because Tim Holtz has amazing style. I love his work. I love his products. They are fam famous. <laughs> they are fabulous. <laughs> Look at those beautiful pockets. It's such a beautiful work, you know, those layerings and the mixing the colors. It's just stunning. So thank you so, so much, Jenny. And thank you so much for your understanding. I'm, I'm so glad you do understand why I forgot that it wasn't like I didn't want to finish that. That it was just because of hard time in my life. It was just bad timing. And here, look at these gorgeousness. So all kind of goodies. And I do love these. I'm not sure if she made them. I think she made these small things as well. And they do look amazing. I'm really not sure if she bought somewhere like um, those plastic thingy or you know these these shapes and then she stick there some stickers and decorated that i will have to ask her or i hope she will write some some uh, notes here or she will make maybe some post on her facebook page so we can we can learn from her really beautiful work so many pockets amazing pockets with so many goodies so thank you so so much for this amazing inspiration i'm gonna keep it outside because it's taking time to put it back it's too many and here is another pocket beautiful work really beautiful work 
and so many goodies. Uh, I couldn't fit everything into my booklet because I made it quite small. So it will be like around in the final box where I want to send her. So this is beautiful work of Jenny. All informations will be down below. Now if I will fold it right way, hopefully. So it's gorgeous, gorgeous book, box with uh, fillet with goodies. And I really love all these small parts, you know, pockets and... Oh, these flowers are so amazing. So amazing. So this is what I have received from Jenny. I'm going to place it on the side and I will show you what I have created for her. Uh, as I said, I used stickers from these two books uh, in my book box or pocket box. And this is what I have created. Uh, I wanted to try something a little bit different, uh, something where I will see through the edges what is inside a little bit. So this is outside. I do have here around belly band and this one it's like, uh, this is exactly like belly band and the closure for my opening box, collapsible box, or I have no idea how to call that. Is here so when I open it I can open this one on four sides and here you can see how I used those stickers uh, from the those uh, two books they are so amazing so I'm gonna start with I think this was first one I created I created four frames and then those four frames I used as a topper for my pocket and it's like a double pocket so one pocket is right behind that see-through uh, the box and then is another pocket which is like behind that base so there is another pocket with some goodies i'm not gonna show everything what is inside but they are uh, handmade uh, decorations for journals and some ephemeras and some tacks so i adhere my handmade embellishments as well uh, i didn't adhere everything oh i think you got open i didn't adhere everything because it just couldn't fit so <laughs> that rest jenny will receive in the box so this was second frame i created and i forgot to show you yeah forgot to show you so these are the stickers uh, from the books here I used glossy accent and I used a little bit of glossy accent on that e or, or more uh, I wiped the, the brush on that uh, here I used uh, this is that key mm, letter key from Tim Holtz uh, this one is what I made from uh, Sizzix embossing folder with those uh, typewriter letters so that's that's the one and here is second frame I have created again using those stickers from the book and again it is see-through and I do have there just a few dies and wooden frames I made those pockets for it and also it's uh, again the pocket behind you can add that this way or get that this way and then uh, <clears throat> it was this this small one with a cut and I really love this image it's so beautiful probably because there is a number so I added a glossy accent on that number as well uh, here I use these stickers and I made again the frame kind of like see-through frame so it's all empty space and I love that effect. I do love that effect of these stickers together. And again, my packaging with embellishments. And uh, this pocket has also another po pocket or it's more like belly band. And it's right here and you can get there from both sides. And inside I do have uh, handmade paper clips. And another stuff. 
so this is totally different from my usual work and it's just because of those gorgeous stickers those sticker books are those images inside they just motivate you or inspire you to create something and this was last frame I have created with those hands and I really enjoyed that I used also my new sewing machine to add there some sewing and uh, if you noticed I did sewn all that acetate because of that sewing machine so here I do have this vintage photos inside so I do have their collection of uh, vintage vintage photos for for Jenny if she will want to add them to her journals these beautiful ladies and there is also second pocket and it's made again like a belly band from this side so I do, do have there some embellishments and tags and you can take it out from both sides and as you can see I add uh, a lot of sewing or stitching because of that <laughs> sewing machine it's awesome so this is my small creation for Jenny and I really hope she will like it uh, I was so happy to create uh, something using these awesome, awesome, amazing stickers. They are just so gorgeous. So I do believe I will use these stickers, I think, mostly this way, uh, to give them the chance to, to shine because the, all those stickers in these books are a work of art literally work of art so this is my small sharing and yeah it's another kind of like holder here <clears throat> where I do have few uh, few tags which can be used in journals so this is my small sharing for today I do hope you took some inspiration uh, the Jenny work is stunning I will add uh, information down below please go to check her uh, Facebook page I do believe she does have Facebook page at least I hope I do remember that right this is quite full so I'm gonna try to wrap it up somehow so this is my creation for her. That rest will be in the box I'm creating for this box. <laughs> Gonna bring it back. I need to place it. Place all these goodies back to pockets. So this is my very short uh, sharing for today. Thank you so, so much for spending your time with me. Thank you so much for uh, visiting me today. I hope you found some inspiration. I hope you had a good time. Uh, have a beautiful day. Take care about yourself and I will see you soon. Bye. Oh, by the way, I'm not sure if I said that. I do have full tutorial for this one on my Patreon, including all the images, all these tags you see inside. They are uh, on my Patreon as well. They are from last year, from collections from last year. But if you will sign up for this tutorial, you will get access to everything I ever shared on my on my Patreon and there is a lot. So that's all. Thank you so much for visiting me. Have a beautiful day. Take care about yourself and I will see you soon. Bye.